What's up guys, my name is Devin, also known as FBE, and welcome back to another episode of Footballers. In today's video, we're going to be bringing you guys another episode of the What Players Were on the Field series, and today's player is going to be Jets rookie corner, Sauce Gardner. Alright guys, let's finally get into the video. We're going to kick things off by starting at the head, and that means we're going to talk about the helmet. So, for his helmet, Sauce Gardner wears a cheese head. It's a nice, awesome dairy product to protect your head. Just kidding. Just kidding. Just a joke. Just a joke, guys. For his helmet, Sauce Gardner has been wearing the Shut F7 since 2019 during his college days at Cincinnati. The Shut F7 is super common among skilled players because it's lightweight and more low profile than the options from Riddell and Vices. As I've mentioned before in some other videos, it seems that smaller guys like corners tend to gravitate towards shut football helmets. So the F7, Air XPs, even the Vengeance line, they seem to wear those because again, they're more low profile and they're lighter weight than some of the other brands on the market. The F7 is also a super comfortable helmet. They have these nice little pods on the inside that are super soft. They feel really good. And the shut F7 is also a super safe helmet, scoring a perfect five out of five on the Virginia Tech helmet rating scale. One of the keys to the high safety ratings is these unique plates that you guys see on the top of the helmet. These are what Shut calls their tectonic plates. And what they do is when you guys get hit, these plates move independently from the rest of the shell to help disperse that rotational impact and prevent it from reaching your head. Overall, the Shut F7 is a great option for skilled players. It's definitely my favorite helmet on the market. It's lightweight, it's comfortable, and it's super safe. Unfortunately, since the season is kind of underway, it seems that most places that sell helmets are kind of low on stock. Um, but we will put a link in the description to Green Gridiron, who often has these helmets, so you guys can keep an eye on their site. Um, so when they come up, you guys can grab them. Also, just something to keep in mind as you guys watch this video, every single product we talk about will be linked in the description below, so you guys can shop Sauce's Locker right there in the description. Next thing we're going to talk about is his face mask. On his F7, Sauce is rocking with the F7-TEGOP face mask. So let's break down that code real quick. The F7 stands for what face mask the helmet is built for. The T stands for titanium, which is the material the mask is built from. The EG stands for those eye guards that you guys see on the face mask. And then OP stands for oral protection, which is the lower part of the face mask. Eye guards are super common among DBs, and I think it kind of just completes that DB look. Um, something about these bars, they're not really as much for protection, um, but they look really good. You guys can't tell me different. It is the perfect look for defensive back. If you guys want to get this face mask for yourself, Green Gridiron has the titanium one for 150 and then a heavier steel option for just 50 bucks. Next thing we're going to talk about is Sauce's visor. For just one game and a couple practices this year, Sauce wore a clear Oakley Pro visor on his shot F7. This visor is not flashy, it's not special, it's just a super simple Oakley clear visor and of course Oakley is the official optics provider of the NFL. When he wore his Oakley visor, he wore it with Oakley's quick release clips which are becoming pretty standard in the NFL. If you guys want to grab this visor for yourself, Green Great Iron has them for 70 bucks, linked in the description below. Next up, we have another important piece of the helmet setup, and that's going to be the chin strap. Sauce is rocking with the Sports Star Victory T-Rex Hurricane chin strap. You guys have probably seen, but I do have these chin straps on all of my helmets, and I can't recommend them enough. They're great. Now, the final piece of Sauce's helmet setup is a minor piece, but crucial. That's going to be the mouth guard. Sauce wears the Shock Doctor Bolt mouth guard in an all-white colorway. Now, we've talked about the Shock Doctor mouth guards, more specifically the Bolt, a ton on this channel already, but they are becoming super popular in the NFL. These are a high-quality, comfortable mouth guard that comes in a ton of colorways. You guys can identify these mouth guards by the little tiny bolt on the strap. Lucky for you guys, these chin straps look good and they're pretty inexpensive. They're only 14 bucks on Shock Doctor's website. We will link it in the description for you. All right, guys, now that we've talked about the entire helmet setup, it's time to talk about the shoulder pads. Sauce is wearing the X-Tech X2 shoulder pads. Now, I don't know about you guys, but when I watch Sauce, one thing I noticed right away is how low profile his shoulder pads are. It sometimes looks like he's not wearing any shoulder pads at all, and that is one of the many benefits of the X-Tech X2 shoulder pads. They're low profile and they're super lightweight. Another key attribute about these shoulder pads is that they allow Sauce to mirror the defender, stick with them, and then react to the football, make an adjustment, and make a play on the ball. Also, just a quick note, uh, X-Tech is super common among the Jets and the Giants because they are based out of New Jersey, so they're right in the backyard of both those teams. Sauce also wears the X-Tech five-sided vented backplate to protect that lower back. If you guys want to grab these shoulder pads, they are going to cost you quite a pretty penny. They cost $550 on x -Tech's website, and the back plate is $75. Bucks. Both are linked in the description below. Next thing we're going to talk about is arm sleeves. Now, it seems every single game, Sauce is wearing some kind of material on his arms. Now, for some games this season, Sauce has gone with the double shooter sleeve look. Now, it's pretty much impossible to tell exactly which brand arm sleeves these are, but my best guess would be that they were Nike, because not only are the NFL uniforms made by Nike, Sauce is also signed with them. When Sauce decides to rock the two shooter sleeves, he always wears them in all black, which somehow actually complements the Jets uniforms pretty nicely. I think it's because of that black face mask they added last year or the year before. Since we don't know exactly which sleeves they are, we're just going to leave a link to all of the arm sleeves that Champ Sports has to offer, link below. Now, staying on the topic of sleeves, Sauce for some other games this year has rolled with the baggy undershirt long sleeve look. 
You guys are constantly asking me what this shirt is, so I'm finally gonna give you guys a solid answer. These are a long sleeve Nike dry fit, but these guys are sizing up just to get that nice baggy effect. Now, to my surprise, these shirts are actually pretty tough to find, but lucky for you guys, we are going to be making them available to you guys. And we're also gonna include some awesome customization options. So you guys can put your number, your team name, your last name, whatever you guys want on the sleeve. So it kind of pokes out a little bit, super subtle, dope swag. You guys are gonna love it, so stay tuned. The next accessory we're going to talk about is one of my favorites, and that's going to be gloves. For this season, Sauce has been wearing the Nike Vaporjet 7.0s. So far, we've seen him wear them in a white colorway, a black colorway, and a green colorway. So pretty much all the colorways of the Jets. If you guys have watched this channel, you guys know I absolutely love the Nike Vaporjet 7.0. I think they are truly the best glove in football right now. They fit great, they're super comfy, the grip is awesome, and they look amazing. If you guys want more information on these gloves, we do have a full review. So if you guys haven't watched that, please do. It's awesome. Check it out. If you guys want to get a pair for yourself, they're going to be 50 bucks. We're going to link them in the description for you guys. All right, guys, we've made it all the way to the end. So it's time to talk about the cleats. Sauce Gardner is in the Nike Vapor Edge 360 Speed. So far, we've seen Sauce wear these in pretty basic colorways. He's worn a white pair and a black pair. But these cleats are truly a perfect fit for Sauce. Sauce is one of those lanky, speedy defenders that needs to cut on a dime. And these cleats are lightweight, they're low cut, and they have one of the best traction plates in football, the edge plate, which like I said, it allows him to cut on a dime, react to the football, and return it the other way for six. If you guys do want to grab a pair for yourself, you guys can grab one from Champ Sports for 95 bucks. They've got the really cool Air Max 95 colorways. Go check them out, link in the description. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, considering like, Comment which player you guys want to see next and subscribe for more videos just like this one. My name is Evan, also known as FBE, and thank you guys so much for tuning into another episode of Footballers.